Each cylinder is fitted with a variable injection timing fuel pump. It is mounted on the roller guide housing on top of the camshaft. Two racks are fitted in the base of the pump. The upper rack is for adjusting the injection timing by timing guide, and the lower rack is for adjusting the quantity of fuel oil delivered by the regulating guide. The threaded lower end in the pump barrel fits into the internal threads of the timing guide. Gear rim in the timing guide meshes with the upper toothed rack located at the base of the pump housing. Relative to the plunger, the toothed rack's position determines the vertical position of the barrel and thus the time of fuel injection. The pump plunger is fitted with the barrel to form an oil-tight seal. The plunger is turned by the regulating guide, which engages with the lower toothed rack. The position of the plunger determines the amount of oil injected into the cylinder. The top cover houses the puncture valve and the suction valve. The oil is supplied to the pump through the spring-loaded suction valve. The puncture valve is operated by the control air system. On actuation, it bypasses the oil through the bores to the pump housing, and no injection takes place.